Hey guys, it's Kiki, and today I'm just going to be doing like a quick video, just update y'all on my pregnancy and everything. I'll be 23 weeks tomorrow. I just had my 22-week appointment with my OB, and I had my second appointment with my high-risk specialist. Um, so at my OB appointment, they said that everything was fine. Um, his heart rate was fine and everything. Um... He basically was telling me, sorry, I had something in mind. He basically was, my doctor was basically telling me that I basically like, okay, yes, I have high blood pressure, but I don't need to be like taking my blood pressure all the time. I don't need to be taking my blood pressure all the time and stressing myself out about it. Basically, I need to just take my medicine. And he basically said like, if I feel like anything's wrong, like if I feel my heart beating too fast or, you know, I feel myself swelling up or anything like that, that's when I should take my blood pressure and be worried or come into the hospital um but he said other than that just like take it easy you know it's funny because i call my doctor by his first name because he's so nonchalant while he's so on top of stuff and i love him as a doctor like he takes care of everything right when it needs to be taken care of like no late shit nothing he's like very on it i have no complaints so far about him but when i do come in and i like i'm so worried or like have a question like he's so nonchalant and like he puts all my thoughts at ease like He's just a really good doctor. So that was my appointment. Um, and then with my appointment today, we did ultrasound, which that's really all I do at my um, high risk specialist. They do ultrasound and measure baby. And they just make sure that me having high blood pressure is not affecting my baby's growth or his development. Um, last time we went to him, I was almost 20 weeks and no, I was almost 19 weeks and they um and they let me know that he was one day ahead now this appointment i'm almost 23 weeks and he's two days ahead in measurements with and he's supposed to be um a pound five ounces so everything looks great my high blood pressure is not stunting his development or anything um so yeah like everything's looking pretty fine um as far as that goes now symptoms um i've noticed i'm a little bit more tired through the day i'm a little bit more tired through the day but i can't sleep um i can't sleep but at night time i'm not tired and i actually stay up until like 3 a.m um kind of like an insomnia thing to where i'm finally like i'll put my phone down and try to go to sleep and then i'll toss and turn until i fall asleep um that's a symptom another symptom is i keep having like these dizzy spells and like feeling like i'm gonna pass out um which is kind of hard to tell i just spoke to my high risk doctor about it and they basically were like explaining to me which i already knew it's kind of hard to tell with stuff like that like feeling faint or dizzy like um you never know if that's just one of your pregnancy symptoms or if there's actually something wrong so i was asking him like what if it's a sugar thing and he was just like, well, when is your sugar test supposed to come? I'm supposed to have it at 25 weeks, my doctor already told me. So he was like, yeah, I would say just wait it out. He was like, of course, if you faint, go into the hospital. But other than that, you know, just do what you normally do. Breathe it out, you know, stuff like that. Lay down, maybe sit down. Whatever you can do or what you normally do to calm it down. Um, and then, of course, when I take my sugar test, we'll figure out if this has been because I have gestational diabetes or it's just one of my symptoms of pregnancy which we'll see um as far as cravings this is so funny since my last video i never really had cravings during pregnancy it'd be like i don't know i just really loved sweets in the beginning um now i'm able to like control myself i don't have to get sweets i don't have to eat sweets um now it's kind of like for for the past week and a half almost two weeks I was like in love with pancakes and anybody who knows me knows that never a day in my life has Kiki ever enjoyed pancakes. Like I've always hated pancakes. Um, hate, hate, hate pancakes. And the only time I would eat pancakes is if my mom made them and she would put cinnamon in them. And really the only reason why I would eat them is because my mom's one of those people and like if I cooked and you don't want to eat what's here, then you're just going to have to starve because that's all we have. So um yeah that was the only time i would eat pancakes is if 
my mom was making them with cinnamon. But the past two weeks, I've been like, I need pancakes, pancakes. And it's like Denny's pancakes, not any pancakes, just Denny's, which is like a breakfast spot. I'm pretty sure they have them everywhere. I'm not sure, but um, yeah, love pancakes. Um, I'm kind of over it because I'm just tired of going to Denny's. But if somebody was to just like bring me some pancakes from Denny's, I'd be like, okay, bet. <laughs> um, that is that. I really don't think there's anything else. Um, I'll do pictures of my belly and like a little video at the end of this. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Peace. Love you guys. Bye.